Hi and welcome to Vincenzo's Plate. In this episode we are going to make Vincenzo's Plate beans dip. Yes, it is a very fun dish to make. I usually make it when I have uh, friends over for movie night and I believe it's a perfect dish or snack to have while you watch a film, together with popcorn, of course. Um, sometimes I also have it for dinner because beans have a significant amount of fiber and they are also very high in protein and uh, high. So what we need for this dish is fresh parmesan, grana padano or parmigiano reggiano, a small piece of garlic, a can of whole mixed beans, salt, parsley, a, a can of butter beans, some basil, extra virgin olive oil and a nice fresh focaccia bread. Okay, so firstly we need to turn the oven on. So we need to turn the oven at 150. We are going to use the oven for our focaccia. So we can put it in there for about two minutes and so it becomes nice and crusty. So now we have all the ingredients and we need to get a nice food processor like this, nice old fashioned one. If you have a new one, it's better. <laughs> and we put about four, five tablespoons of extra virgin olive oil. You should put a lot. Now we put the garlic in, piece of garlic, and we just put a little bit of beans, not all of them, just a little bit now. Then we put the rest later, just half and half. And put the food processor on. We just need to add a little bit of water, maybe half glass of water, because um, we need to make it a little bit more uh, running. So I've got water here. Not too much. Uh, let's see. Okay, now it's working. So now we put the parsley in. Or parsley. Now we're going to put the rest of the beans. So butter beans and mixed beans. Put it together. We turn it on. Now it's perfect. So all we need to do now, we just want to put a little bit of uh, Parmesan cheese here. Oh, I love it. Love the smell. We just put a little bit extra or extra virgin olive oil, just a little bit at the end. Just not much, maybe one tablespoon and a half. This is almost ready, so we're gonna place the focaccia in the oven for about two minutes. And now we're gonna do this for about a minute. So the dip is now ready, it does smell good, so I'm pretty sure it's ready. Now let's get a chopping board, so now we're getting our bread, <laughs> it's nice and hot. The bread needs to be nice and crunchy, so if you, if you think it needs to stay a little bit longer, just leave it in the oven a little bit longer. Now we're going to cut it like this. So now I'll place the bread in this nice plate. We have a little bowl here. And we're going now to place the dip in this bowl like this. You can have a spoon to help you. Oh yeah, it does. The final touch, we're putting some basil there. A little bit of mixed herbs, just like that. Not too much. Now the dish is ready to be enjoyed. Thank you very much for watching this episode. I will see you in the next Vincenzo's Plate recipe. E ora! Si mangia Vincenzo's plate.